Ukraine forming multi-level protection for energy facilities. In Ukraine, five nuclear power units have already been repaired, while four more are currently being repaired. Prime Minister Denis Shmihal said this in a post on Facebook. We understand that there is a high probability that Russians will continue massive attacks on the power system. As to NPPs, five nuclear units have been repaired, four more are under repair. As to TPPs, 62% of the planned power units have been repaired. As to TPPs, 70% have been repaired. As to HPPs, 32 units have been repaired or under repair, Shmihal wrote. He noted that Ukrainergo has already repaired almost 80% of the main networks. High voltage substations have already been restored to a pre-war level. The repair campaign goes according to plan. We are forming multi-level protection for energy facilities, the Prime Minister added. According to Serhiy Nayev, the commander of the Joint Forces of the Armed Forces of Ukraine, Russia will continue shelling Ukraine's critical infrastructure in the winter, so more air defense systems are needed. Of course, the Russian Federation can shell critical energy system facilities, including in winter. For these actions, Russia can do anything to make things worse for Ukraine and Ukrainians, he said. According to Nayev, Ukraine has already begun preparing to protect energy system facilities and improve the effectiveness of the air defense system. But we have to understand that we are to some extent dependent on the supplies of air defense equipment provided by our partners. The more equipment we receive, the more we will make it impossible for enemy drones and missiles to successfully strike critical energy facilities, the general added.